All right, Jeffy, it's time to eat lunch. Oh boy, that means I get to eat cookies. Well, no, 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 Jeffy, you're not eating cookies for lunch. You're gonna eat a big old plate of green beans. But Daddy, you know I hate green beans. Why can't you get it through your thick, bald head that I don't like green beans? Well, Jeffy, I know you don't like green beans, but they're healthy and they'll make you grow big and strong. Well, cookies will make me big too. Well, they'll make you big like fat. Well, then I'll be just like you. Jeffy! Well, Jeffy, I am not fat. Look, look, green beans have fiber and then they'll help you poop. Daddy, I already crap my pants twice a day. I don't need help pooping. That's well, because of the green beans, Jeffy. Yes, Jeffy, green beans are good for you. So look, you're gonna eat these green beans. I can't. Well, yes, you can, Jeffy. You're not allergic to them because if you were allergic, then you wouldn't have to eat them. But you're not allergic, so eat them, Jeffy. Hmm, allergic. I got an idea. <laughs> Jeffy, did you eat your green beans? Jeffy, where'd you go, Jeffy? Maybe he went to his room, Marvin. Jeffy, you are so grounded for not eating your green beans. Uh, oh, Jeffy, what happened to you? Yeah, Jeffy, what happened? I was trying to take a bite of green beans and then my face started hurting. <gasps> Marvin, maybe Jeffy is allergic to green beans. Yeah, that. What? No, Jeffy, you're not allergic to green beans. You've never been allergic before. But Marvin, you can develop allergies at any age. Yeah, I read that too. You can't read, Jeffy. Oh, I saw it on TV. What? There's no way he's allergic. Are you sure you didn't fall and hit your face? No, I did not fall. You promised you didn't fall? I promised that was not it. Oh, oh, okay, look, well, I will call a doctor and we're going to figure out what's going on. You better not be faking it. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Yes, doctor. We tried to feed Jeffy green beans and his face looked like that. What, you beat the shit out of him for not eating his green beans? Yeah, he does it all the time. Not this time. Not this time? Look, I put a plate of green beans in front of Jeffy. I walked away, I came back, and he looked like that. What happened, kid? Did you fall down? No, I promise that was not it. We think it might be an allergic reaction? Well, it doesn't look like an allergic reaction. It looks like somebody hit him in the face with a baseball bat. Well, what does an allergic reaction look like? Well, you know, usually you get a rash, maybe get itchy, have trouble breathing. So what type of weapon causes that? What? Nothing. I'll figure it out. Oh, so, so it's not an allergic reaction? Well, I mean, if you're saying that he looks like this after eating green beans, then I guess we have to assume it's an allergic reaction. Oh, so that means I don't have to eat green beans anymore. Yeah, I'd stay away from the green beans. What about cookies? Cookies should be fine. All right, pee pee. Well, no, you're not eating cookies for lunch, Jeffy. What else should I feed him? I don't know. He's not an iguana. He doesn't need a special diet. Feed him whatever you want, just not green beans. All right, Jeffy, we're going to find something for you to eat that you're not allergic to. Come on, Jeffy. Like cookies. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Wait, no, no, Jeffy. Hey! No cookies. You're gonna eat Brussels sprouts. But the doctor said cookies! No, the doctor said you have to eat something healthy, so here's Brussels sprouts. Daddy, these look like the Jolly Green Giant's testicles! Jeffy! Jeffy, these are good for you. They're really good. They're a nice vegetable. And they smell like the patch of skin between your ball sack and your butthole. Jeffy, just eat them. But Daddy, she's a 10, but she smells like this. Jeffy, I know they don't smell good, but they taste good. Look, just try it. Please try it. Oh, Daddy, I don't want to try these. I got to make sure you're not allergic. Try it. Uh, Jeffy, uh, put it in your mouth. Uh, uh, Jeffy, uh, Jeffy, put it back in your mouth. I don't like it, Daddy. Try it, Jeffy, try it. I think I'm allergic. My throat's closing up. Put it back in your mouth. Uh, uh, is it good? Uh, uh. Okay, well, swallow it. Come on, baby, let's go. So, Jeffy, how was the Brussels sprouts? Jeffy! What has happened to your face? I definitely think I'm allergic to the Brussels sprouts, Daddy. It's so messed up. What is going on? I can't breathe, Daddy. Marvin, we need to call the doctor. Oh, okay, okay. I'm going to call a doctor. Daddy, I need... What, what do you need? I need... What do you need, Jeffy? Cookies! You're not eating cookies, Jeffy. We have to call a doctor. Come on. Aww. Hey there, you call me again? Yes, doctor. I gave my son Brussels sprouts, and now his face looks like this. Oh, my God. I know. It's so bad. Oh, my God. I'm going bald. Oh, God. The bald spot on the back of my head is getting so big. Well, I'm going bald in the front, too? I'm getting bukkake by my hairline. Oh, man, I used to have a full head of hair. Ugh, I hate getting old. Be honest, does it look bad? Um, I would say it's noticeable. Oh, I'm so ugly. Oh, man, we gotta do something about this. We gotta do, like, Brooklyn guy's hair problem fix or, or Brooklyn guy's hair transplant or something. I mean, I guess I could wear a hat. That might cover it up. You think I'd look good as a hat guy? I want you to help me fix Jeffy. Oh, yeah, what about your son? I gave him Brussels sprouts, and now his face looks like this. Okay, you have to be beating him. Facts. No, I'm not beating him. I gave him a plate of Brussels sprouts. I walked away, and now his face is more 
more bruised and his eye is swollen. Well, it doesn't look like an allergic reaction. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if his jaw and cheekbones weren't broken. So what's causing this? I don't know. I mean, I guess it has to be a severe allergic reaction to green beans and Brussels sprouts. So we won't feed him Brussels sprouts and we won't feed him green beans. Would cookies help? I, I don't think cookies would help. I'd suggest you get an EpiPen. No, I don't think I need that. I think I need cookies. You're not eating cookies, Jeffy. We gotta find you a food that you're not allergic to. So come on, we're gonna go find you something to eat. Let's go. What about cookies? Come here, cookie. One bite. Ha. Ah, no cookies. Hey. I said no cookies, Jeffy. It's time for you to eat something else. Well, then what am I supposed to eat, Daddy? You're gonna eat a big old plate of spinach. Daddy, you can't just diarrhea on your plate and expect me to eat it. It's not diarrhea, Jeffy. It's spinach. It's good for you. Like, f it is. Jeffy, language. Look, just eat it. Daddy, if there's anything I'm allergic to, I'm allergic to this. Where's my bat? Oh, Marvin, what's this bat doing on the ground? Shit. Uh, I, I don't know. Jeffy, were you playing with this bat? No. Well, baby, put it away somewhere. Okay. But that was my allergic device. What? Nothing. Jeffy, just eat the spinach. Look, just try it. I promise you'll love it. Daddy, I highly doubt I'll love this. Just try it, Jeffy. Oh, I don't want to, Daddy. Put it in your mouth. Go. Uh, ah, Jeffy, ah, stop it. Ah, try it. Ow, hey. Try it. Try it. Try it. <laughs> See? It's really good. <laughs> Dinosaurs eat stuff like that. <laughs> Aren't you a dinosaur? <laughs> okay, Jeffy. Look, it's good. Just eat it. Well, I'll be right back. <laughs> Marvin, did Jeffy like his spinach? I don't know. Let's see. Jeffy, did you like your spinach? Ooga booga booga booga! Ah! Stupid dog, you make me look bad. Jeffy, you look even worse. Your eyes get me out of your head. What is going on with... Wait, what's this mallet doing here? Oh, my bad. Marvin, we need to call a doctor right now! Oh, okay. Well, we have to call a doctor. Jeffy, do you think you're allergic to the spinach? Yeah, I told you if there was anything I was going to be allergic to, it'd be this! Oh, wait, look, I'm so sorry, Jeffy. I'm sorry for trying to make you eat this. Let's go call a doctor. Come on. Cookies! Hey there, you are calling me a lot today. Look, I gave my son Jeffy a can of spinach and his face got even worse. Are you sure you didn't give him cream spinach? Because he looked like he got creamed. You know, like when somebody says, I'm going to cream you. Wait, that's from the hub. Never mind. Well, what's going on? Look, look, Jeffy's face is getting worse and worse. Do you do something about it? Well, he's obviously allergic to all the stuff you're giving him. And you can't help him? I'm not really good with allergies. The only thing I'm allergic to is fresh cut grass. Fresh cut grass? Yeah, I know. It's kind of a stupid thing to be allergic to. But let me tell you how I found out about it. So, a few years ago, I go outside to check my mail. And I see my neighbor Chuck cutting his grass. And I'm like, Chuck, what the hell are you doing? It's like 95 degrees out here. You're going to get heat stroke. But I guess he just likes cutting his grass. So, I go to check my mail. And I smell all that fresh cut grass grass, and I fall on the ground, and I start choking, and I start seizing up, and when the ambulance gets there, they tell me it's because I'm allergic to fresh-cut grass. So then, a few years after that, I joined the military, and I'm at war in a place that's really grassy, and I'm behind enemy lines, getting shot at, and all that, and then all of a sudden, the enemy starts charging us with lawnmowers, cutting all the grass in sight. So I smell that grass again, and I start seizing up, and I can't breathe, and I almost died. But then I got to meet the president, and he gave me a purple heart, because I'm a hero. So yeah, that's what I'm allergic to. Okay, well, how's that gonna help with Jeffy? You gotta help us figure out what's going on because it looks like he's about to die. Well, look, every time you give him vegetables, he just keeps getting worse and worse. So I shouldn't give him any more vegetables. Ding, ding, ding! Cookies! Jeffy, you can't just eat cookies. Doctor, what is healthier than vegetables? I don't know. What are you, like, five? Give him fruit or something. No, fruits are too yummy. I, I don't want Wow, to... Daddy, screw you! No, no, fruits are just, like, really bright and colorful. I want him to eat something healthy, like fish or... Look, Jeffy, we will find something for you to eat. Come on, let's find... What it. about cookies? Daddy, just let me eat cookies! No, Jeffy, you're not gonna eat cookies! A cookie a keeps the doctor away. Look, Jeffy, you're gonna eat macaroni and cheese! But Daddy, you ruined it by putting boogers in it! Those aren't boogers! Marvin, the doctor said that Jeffy can't eat any more vegetables. Baby, I'm just trying to make sure he's not faking it. Faking it? Look at his face! Yeah, Daddy, I'm not faking it! It's not like I'm hitting myself in the face with a baseball bat or a mallet! I have to be clinically insane! do something like that. Sometimes I wonder if you're insane, Jeffy. Marvin! Uh, listen, Jeffy, just eat it. Look, it's macaroni and cheese. It's yummy. You're gonna love it. But Daddy, you keep insisting that I eat vegetables, and now I'm gonna have the worst allergic reaction yet, and my ear's gonna fall off. Your ear's not gonna fall off, Jeffy. Don't be ridiculous. All right, we'll see. Come on, baby. Let's let him eat. Okay. Okay, Jeffy, did you enjoy your mac and cheese? I can't hear you, Daddy. What'd you say? Marvin, his ear fell off! 
Look what you did, Daddy. This is all your fault. Wouldn't tell me you did not lose your ear by eating vegetables. Yes, I did because I'm allergic. Wait a second, Marvin. What are those scissors doing here? Shit. What, scissors? Wait a minute. Scissors, the mallet, and the bat. The scissors, the mallet, and the bat in the dining room where Jeffy was eating his vegetables and now he looks like that. You just figured out Blue's Clues. You just figured out Blue's Clues. You just figured out Blue's Clues because I did it to myself. Well, what? You did this to yourself, Debbie? Yes, because all I wanted was cookies. Debbie, cookies is not worth all this. Yes, it is. I hate green beans. Debbie, you are insane. And don't you forget it. Well, you Marvin, just let him eat the damn cookies before he dies. Fine, Debbie. You want cookies that bad? Eat all the damn cookies you want. But when you get fat, I don't want to hear it. Can we at least put your ear back on, Jimmy? <sighs> He's insane. Yes. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Jeffy, why are you singing that song? Marvin, it's not his birthday, is it? I don't think so. Because it's my birthday, now. Well, it's your birthday. Oh, no, Marvin, it is his birthday. How could we forget? I don't know. You ever forgot my birthday? Well, no, we didn't forget your birthday. We just thought it was tomorrow. That means you forgot. <laughs> Best birthday party ever, like uh, with a cake and confetti. Baby, go get a cake. Okay. With, with confetti. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna, we'll give you the best birthday ever. So let's start with your birthday dinner. Where do you want to go for your birthday dinner? Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Yeah, I want a bean taco from Taco Bell. All right, that's easy. All right, let's go to Taco Bell. All right. Thank you for tasting Taco Bell. What can I get started for you today? Uh, just one second. What do you want, Jeffy? I want a taco. Okay. With beans. With beans? Yep, just beans. Only beans and shell. Uh, okay. And don't forget the hot sauce. Don't forget, okay. Can I get a taco? Alright, that's one crunchy taco. What else for you? And hot sauce. 182, please drive around. Don't forget the hot sauce. If you forget the hot sauce, I swear I'm gonna, I'm gonna steal the Taco Bell sauce. They're not gonna forget the hot sauce. Alright, good. All right, Jeffy, just sit right here and eat your Taco Bell because I think Mommy's almost done setting up your party downstairs. All right, Daddy. Everything's set up, Marvin. Everything's set up? Yep. So you got a cake? Yes. With candles? Uh-huh. And confetti? Yeah. You gotta be shitting me! Jeffy language! What's wrong, Jeffy? Those effers forgot my hot sauce! Jeffy, stop saying effers. No, they forgot my hot sauce, Daddy! They didn't forget the hot sauce. I told them like 15 times. Well, it's not in there. Well, can you just eat it without hot sauce? No! I wanted hot sauce for my bean taco. Do so you know what that means? They're gonna get their Taco Bell sign stolen. We're not stealing a Taco Bell sign, Jeffy. Yes, we are. No, we're not, Jeffy. Look, just eat your taco. And look, there's a cake downstairs. Let's go blow out the candles. No, I gotta go steal their Taco Bell sign. No, Jeffy. Let's go blow out the candles on your cake and celebrate your birthday. Come on. And then we get to go steal the Taco Bell shot. Surprise! It's not a surprise because you already told me about it. Jeffy, look, she got you a cake and plates. Who emptied a paper shredder all over the table? It's confetti, Jeffy. It's fun. We so fun. Look, Jeffy, we're going to sing you happy birthday, then you're going to blow out your candles, and then we'll get you whatever you want. Okay. Happy birthday to you. Jeffy, we weren't done singing. All right, the first thing I want for my birthday is everyone who's watching this video to go ahead and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. I'll wait. Did you do it? All right, great. Thanks for my birthday present. Oh, Jeffy, and everyone who didn't do it has no friends. Jeffy, what do you really want for your birthday? Well, what I really want for my birthday is the Taco Bell sign. Jeffy, we can't get you the Taco Bell sign. Well, they ruined my birthday, so I'm going to ruin their business by stealing their sign. Baby, we have to go get him the Taco Bell sign. Marvin, you can't steal the Taco Bell sign. It's illegal. <sighs> Jeffy, we can't get you the Taco Bell sign. <laughs> Worst birthday ever! I'm gonna keep screaming until I get the Taco Bell sign. Here's your Jeffy. We'll get you the Taco Bell sign. Marvin, you better not. Come on, Jeffy. Let's go get the stupid sign. <gasps> All right, Jeffy, what part of the sign do you want? I want the big bell and the one that says taco. All right, I'm gonna get a ladder and let's go up there and get it. All right. <laughs> All right, Jeffy, there's your Taco Bell sign. Best daddy ever! Marvin, you didn't! Well, well, it's the only thing he wanted for his birthday. Now I'll teach him for forgetting my hot sauce. How did you even do that? It's called a drill, mommy. <laughs> and a ladder. What? Well, we forgot Jeffy's birthday, and I felt bad, so I thought, you know, if we got the Taco Bell sign, he'd be happy. And uh, isn't it worth it to see that smile on his face? What are you going to do when they notice? They're not going to notice. Everybody knows where Taco Bell is. They don't need a sign. Oh, you're going to go to jail. I'm not going to.
gonna go to jail. The, the, the Taco Bell has like a billion dollars. They can just buy another sign. That's not the point, Marvin. It's wrong. What well, wrong, schmong? Marvin, look the news. Breaking news, okay? Someone has stolen the sign off of a Taco Bell, and no one can tell what restaurant it is. The police are holding a live press conference now. Let's go to that. Thanks, Goodman. As you can see from this picture here, this is a Taco Bell. I, I think. See, I don't know, because there's no sign out front, because somebody stole it. You know, so, so restaurants have signs in front of them so that you know where you're going. But now, nobody knows what's going on. Customers keep coming into the Taco Bell and they're ordering Baconators, thinking it's Wendy's or something, and the workers don't know what's going on either. They're in there trying to make Big Macs with burrito supplies. It's chaos. So listen up. Whoever stole that sign, we're coming for you. Oh, no. Marvin, I don't want any part of this illegal activity. I'm leaving for a couple of days. Well, baby, no, come back. Jeffy, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just polishing my brand new Taco Bell sign. I love it so much. Well, you better love it, because now the cops are looking for us. Oh, oh, no! No! Oh, Daddy, help me! Oh, Jeffy, are you okay? No, oh, Daddy, I'm stuck. I think my legs are broken. It's the worst birthday ever. Please get the sign off me. Okay, I'll get it. Uh, oh, Jeffy, are you sure your legs are broken? Yeah, they, oh, they hurt. Don't touch them. Okay. I need you to call a doctor. I can't call a doctor, Jeffy, because they're looking for the people who stole the Taco Bell sign. And if I call a doctor, they're going to see that we're the people who stole the Taco Bell sign. Then what are we going to do? I don't know. Oh, 315, 316, 317, 318, 319, 320. Wait a minute. It's today. Jeffy's 18th birthday is today. I'm rich. I just gotta get out of this stupid prison first. All right, time for me to use my sexy charm to escape. Hey there, big boy. But shut up, inmate. I'm trying to figure out who stole this Taco Bell sign. Ugh, my back is killing me. Oh, well, I could give you a back massage if you let me out of this cell. No, 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 no. What if you escape? Oh, come on. I wouldn't do that. I love it here. I got my own bed and my own toilet. It's paradise. Oh, I do really want a back massage. Okay, fine. I'll let you out for five minutes to massage my back, but then you're going right back in your cell. Okay. All right. Now I let you out. I really need you to get between my shoulder blades because that's where all my stress is. Okay. <laughs> I knocked him out! I'm free! Oh, damn! Stay still, Jeffy. All right, Jeffy, I wrapped your legs in paper towels. It kind of looks like a cast. But they still hurt, Daddy! Well, if you sit really still and keep your legs straight, eventually they'll heal straight. Because that's how that works. I don't know, Jeffy, I'm not a doctor. Well, then call one! We can't call a doctor, Jeffy, because of your stupid birthday gift. It's illegal. Oh, oh no, who's that? What if it's the cops, Daddy? Look, I'll handle it. You just stay right here and don't make any noise. Okay. All right, if it's the cops, I'm gonna say, what Taco Bell sign? Yeah, that'll work. Hello? Surprise! Ow, my legs hurt so bad. Oh, Jeffy, it's mommy. <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, today's your 18th birthday, and mommy's gonna get paid. Today's not my 18th birthday, it's my 17th birthday. <laughs> nice try, Jeffy, but I've been counting the days in prison. Now come here. <laughs> Huh, the Find My Fugitive app says she's in here somewhere. Uh, oh my god, Marvin, what happened to you? Uh, Jeffy's mom, she hit me in the face with a mallet! Oh my god, so she is in here! Help me! Wait, Jeffy! Come on, let's go upstairs! Wait, 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 upstairs? Yeah, that's where your son is! Uh... Oh, he's gonna see the Taco Bell sign. Uh, no, let's, let's not go upstairs. They can come down here. Can y'all guys come down here? What are you talking about? Let's go! Uh, Wait, can I help you? Uh, just don't look this way. Okay, whatever. Don't come any closer, I'm gonna bonk him. Nancy, why'd you escape from prison? What? Well, it's prison. It sucks. What do you mean? Uh, oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. But why today? Well, today's Jeffy's 18th birthday, and I'm gonna inherit all his money. Well, actually, he's gonna inherit his father's money, and then I'm gonna take his money, but I'm still getting the money. What, no, no, today's not Jeffy's 18th birthday, it's his 17th birthday. No, 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 I've been counting. Well, no, actually, today is his 17th birthday, and I know, because it's also my birthday. Oh, damn it. Yeah, everybody sing happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, to Brooklyn guy. Happy birthday to you. Thank you, that was very nice. 
What will he? You, you, you stop it, stop it. Oh, okay, Nancy, seriously. It, it actually is his 17th birthday. Oh, well, I guess I messed up. Must have counted wrong. It's okay, I'll just break out next year. Yeah, you go ahead and try that. Wait, what are you doing over there? Wait, wait, wait a minute. Is that the Taco Bell sign? Oh, damn it. Okay, who stole this? Oh, uh, it was Nancy. No, no, it's not me. Yeah, yeah, it was you. When you came over, you, you brought the sign with you. No, no, it couldn't have been her. She was in jail when it got stolen. Oh, you're right. Okay, I'm gonna take her back to jail. Then I'm coming back over here. Come on. Oh, no. Jeffy, what do we do? Oh, no, Daddy. Get in there. Congratulations, you just added five years to your sentence. No, 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 where did I go wrong? Well, 17, okay, so Jeffy's 18th birthday is next year, and next year, I'm gonna get you, Jeffy! All right, she's in jail. Now who's next to go to jail? Who stole this sign? All right, officer. Look, it's my son's birthday, and all he wanted for his birthday was a Taco Bell sign, so I stole it for him for his birthday. Really? You, you, you'd you, commit a felony for your son's birthday? That, that's actually really sweet. I wish somebody would commit a felony for my birthday. <laughs> oh, cheer up. I bet someone will commit a felony for your birthday one day. Really? Do you think so? Hold on, I got an idea. Hey, Jeffy, there's two parts to your Taco Bell sign. Do you think we can give one to the police officer? <laughs> He had a bean taco earlier. Oh. Uh. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Okay, it smells like ass in here. I'm just gonna go. You keep the sign. Happy birthday. Hey, Daddy, what are you doing? Just sitting here, Jeffy. What are you doing? I need me some booby candy, Daddy. What? Booby candy? Jeffy, what's booby candy? She they're shaped like tits. But Jeffy, no, you cannot eat these because you might choke on them. But Daddy, I want titty candy! Me too, Jeffy! But you don't see me crying. Look, you can eat these. Look, they're gummy, so you can't choke on them. They're nice and soft. Look, so you start eating those, all right? So soft titty candy? Yes, Jeffy, soft titty candy. Well, tough titty said the kitty, but the milk's still good. Oh, oh, okay, Jeffy, whatever. Just eat your stupid candy. <laughs> Luigi? <laughs> Luigi's calling me! <laughs> Why is Luigi calling me? Uh, I gotta answer, I gotta answer. Uh, hello? Oh, hey, Mario. It's your brother, Luigi. Oh, uh, hey, Luigi. It's so weird hearing from you. What's up? I know. I'm in town, and I figured I would have stopped by and see how things were going. Oh, uh, yeah, of course you could stop by. Jeffy, stop it. Stop it, Jeffy, stop it. Uh, hold on, Luigi. L let me move into another room. It's kind of loud. I'm going into a tunnel or something. Uh, okay, uh, I, I think this is a better spot. I can hear you now. Okay, you can hear me now, brother? Yeah, yep, I, I can hear you now. So, uh, when do you plan on uh, coming over to my house? <laughs> I was thinking like uh, three minutes. Is that a good? With three minutes? I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Three minutes would be would be perfect. You know, my house is so ready. Uh, three minutes would be good. All right, brother. I'll see you soon. All right. Uh, bye, brother. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Luigi's coming. Oh my god. Luigi's coming. Luigi's actually coming. He's gonna be here any minute now. I have to clean the house. I have to make sure everything's perfect because I have to be number one. Okay. So what do I have to hide? What? I, I have to hide, Jeffy. Jeffy, I have to hide you. Jeffy. Ah! Oh my god, Jimmy! 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 Oh no! Jimmy! Jimmy, are you okay? Jimmy! Speak to me! Speak to me, Jimmy! Oh my god! Jimmy! Ah! Jimmy! Hey! Jimmy! He, he choked on the lightsaber! He choked on the lightsaber! Oh my god, doctor! Doctor! Hey, somebody call a doctor? Oh, thank god, doctor, you're here! I think my son's dead, he's dead for real! Hey, get a hold of yourself! Okay. No one's dead until I say they're dead. Oh yeah, he's dead. Well, he's dead? He really is dead? Oh, he's super dead. Well, well then perform CPR, do mouth to mouth. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. What am I, gay? Well, no, but you're a doctor, so you have to do CPR, so put your mouth on his mouth and blow into it. Yeah, that's gross. You can do that if you want to, but I'm not kissing a dead person. What am I, a necrophiliac? I mean, I am, but I'm not gay. Well, then what do we do, Jeff? He's dead. Well, how do you even die? Uh, I, I, I think he choked on a, on a, on a lightsaber. A, 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 a lightsaber? Like... Like a, like a Star Wars lightsaber? What? No! Oh. oh. No, no. Mine then. I think he choked on a lifesaver.
Oh, a lifesaver! <laughs> lifesaver, that, that's hilarious. How's that funny? It's not funny. Well, it's kind of funny, you know, because he choked to death on a lifesaver. You know, it's supposed to save his life. And it's even worse because they're gummies, too. You'd have to be a real idiot to choke to death on gummy lifesavers. Well, I mean, my son's not that bright. Yeah, yeah, I can tell that. You know what's easier than taking candy from a baby? What? Taking candy from a dead kid. That's what I'm doing. These are mine now. You can't stop me. Oh, what are we gonna do about Jeffy dying? <laughs> I don't know. I guess he's just dead forever. You hear that, you Jeffy haters? You can celebrate for the rest of the video, because Jeffy's dead. I can't believe Jeffy's dead. I can't believe it. Oh, hey, now, what are you doing? <laughs> Jeffy! A go 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 Yeah, I'm sorry, that was kind of gay. I, I was going for a Scooby-Doo thing, you know, like, Jinky is a ghost, but... No, that was that was pretty lame. Still though, that 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 is fucking terrifying. Hey, um, Daddy, who's this kid sleeping on the couch? And and why does he have a pencil on his nose? Why are we doing that? And his shirt has Jeffy written on it. Is his name Jeffy too, or did he steal one of my shirts, Daddy? Uh, uh, I'll I'll explain that in a minute, Jeffy. Just just hold on, give me a second. All right, so Jeffy's a ghost. What do we do? I have no idea. I have shit in my pants, and I'm terrified because I've had a lot of my patients die while I was doing surgery on them, and apparently they can just come back and yell at me. So I have a lot to think about. Well, well, well before you go, before you go, oh, Jeffy's ghost is right there. Can't we put his ghost back in his body and he comes back to life? I don't know. I'm not a ghost buster. I don't just have, like, a vacuum that can suck up ghosts. What, am I gay? What, that, that doesn't even make any sense. Yeah, but I'm, but I'm not gay, though. Okay, fine, we get that, but, but you can't help with this? No, no, and if you'll excuse me, I have to run away and scream like a little girl. Oh, okay, Jeffy, so uh, I'm going to explain to you what's going on, okay? So, you see that body right there? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so uh, that that's your body, and you died, and now you're a ghost. I'm a ghost, Daddy? Yeah. But am I a scary ghost, Daddy? Well, well I, I guess so. I guess you're a scary ghost. Boo! Yeah, you're, you're terrifying. Boo! Yes, you're, Jeffy, you're terrifying, and you're scaring me really bad. Boo! So stop saying boo! Boo! Stop saying boo! Boo! Stop saying boo! Boo! Stop saying boo! 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 Okay. Jeffy, calm down. All right, so look, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna find a way to put yourself back inside your butt. Oh no, that's my brother, that's my brother. Oh, all right, Jeffy, look, uh, we're gonna play hide and seek, okay? We're gonna do ghost hide and seek. So, uh, you, wanna play, you wanna play hide and seek? Okay, Daddy, I wanna play hide and seek. Okay, so I'm gonna count to a million and you find a place to hide, okay? Okay, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, so uh, I'm gonna start counting, uh, go. All right. One, two, three, uh, four, five, Six. Uh, hello? Hey, Mario! How's it going, brother? What's up, Luigi? I haven't seen you in forever! I know! I haven't seen you in years! You're looking short! <laughs> well, you're still looking like second place! Oof! Wow, Mario! Your houses are so big! Did you win the lottery? Uh, nope, nope. I just sell a lot of games, unlike you! Oof! <laughs> Dick! What was that? Uh, nothing, Mario. I uh, just wanted to tell you that I have a third sequel coming out for Luigi's Mansion on the Nintendo Switch. So suck a dick! Oh, well, uh, too bad nobody's gonna know what's going on because nobody played the second one because it was only for the DS. Oof! Well, Mario, I'm so sorry. So, so sorry that the Princess Peach didn't marry you at the end of Mario Odyssey. She didn't even give you a kiss. <laughs> Oof. All right, well, anyway, we're done with that. Um, How about you come on inside? Okay. All right, so uh, this is my house. <laughs> Mario, who's that? Who's what? Oh, my God. Uh, yeah, yeah, I forgot. That's, a, that's my son, Jeffy. Yeah, that's, that's Jeffy. Mario, I... I didn't know you had a son. Well, he's not really my son. Uh, he's adopted, you know. He's oh, oh, oh. So you couldn't have a son of your own because you're ugly. Well, no, no. I, it was a very weird situation and it involved like a million dollars, you know. So I, that's why. You know, Mario, now that I think about it, he does look uh, just like you. Ugly. Well, you know what? You're just mad because you had one game for the GameCube and that was the only game that you ever had that was a bestseller. It's a good game. Mario, I take my vacuum, I suck up the ghosts, and I put the ghosts in my machine, and poof, the ghosts are gone. Wait, you suck up ghosts? Yes, Mario, I just said that. You suck up ghosts? Yes, Mario, I suck up the ghosts. Luigi, I need your help. Oh, so now you need my help. Now you need my help after you call me a second place. Okay, okay, look, look, look. my son is actually dead. <laughs> dead? Yeah, he's dead, and uh, his ghost is around the house, and we gotta, we gotta go get it. Good ghost! 
ghosts. You have a game where you catch ghosts. You're not terrified about a ghost. You're right, Mario. I need to get rid of these strong dick energy. Let's go get my vacuum and suck up a decent ghost. Okay, yeah, let's do it. Okay, Mario. I have my vacuum. This baby can suck up anything, Mario. Anything, Mario. <laughs> Uh, okay, Luigi, but it can suck up a ghost, right? Of course, Mario! This baby can suck literally anything! Ghosts, dirt, uh -oh. you... Uh, uh, okay, well, let's look for Jeffy. Um, okay, so, um... Uh, uh, nope, he's not under the hunger... What? Mario, what's that noise, Mario? You're, you're, you're stepping on his cat piano, but... Oh. Yeah, you were stepping on that. Oh, I got the rear scan, Mario. No, no, he's not under that, but... Oh, I know where he's gonna be hiding. Follow me, Luigi. I know where he's hiding. Okay, Mario. All right, Luigi. You see that Cheerio box right there? Yes, brother. Jeffy loves Cheerios, so he's probably hiding in that box. Okay, Mario. So you walk up to the box, you knock it over, and then I'll suck him up. All right. Hey, if he's in there. All right. Let me see. Uh, uh. Oh, hey, Dad! You found me! Mario! Get I'm so scared, Mario! Well, Luigi, suck him up! I know you can do it! Come on! I'm so scared of ghosts, Mario! Luigi, come on! Suck him up! I know you can do it! You're not number two! You're a man! You're a Luigi! You're a Luigi! You can do it! You're right, Mario! I'm a man! Let's do this! I did it, Mario! Luigi! I sucked him up, Mario! You did it, Luigi! Who's the number one now, Mario? Well, uh, it's still me, but you, you did it! Okay, Mario, I'm just gonna press this button to release, uh, Jeffy. Oh, no, no, you're not gonna release him. You're number one. Th thank you! Oh, okay, Mario. Well, let's go put him in the machine and bring him back to life. All right, thank you, Luigi. You're awesome. Come on! All right, Mario, this is the machine. So put the Jeffy's body inside the machine. Uh, okay. Uh. All right, Jeffy, uh, get in there. Uh, all right, now what? Okay, now... Yeah. Okay, so he's as soul is in there now. Now put it on delicate. Okay, delicate. Uh, 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 all right, now what? Okay, now we wait. Uh, <laughs> Mario, I don't think he's okay. Well, no, he is. He's perfectly fine. That, that's, that's Jeffy. Uh, hey, Jeffy, say hi to your Uncle Luigi. He saved your life. Hey, Uncle Luigi. It's Luigi. So, uh, Luigi, thank you so much for saving Jeffy. Oh, I don't know what I'd do, what I'd do without you. Don't mention it, brother. Anytime. <sighs> Thanks for letting me come over, Mario. You helped me get over my fear of a ghost. Well, thank you for coming over, Luigi. If you wouldn't have came over, Jeffy would have been gone forever and this channel would have died. I mean, I did save the channel. It is called a Super Luigi Logan now. Aha, wahoo. I'm a number one. Well, I mean, Super Mario Logan still has 6 million subscribers. Yeah, but I got all the ads. You are your ads at, huh? <laughs> you don't got any. I'm number one. Suck it. Bye. All right, Crass. Today, we're going to be learning the alphabet. So sing along with me, Crass. <clears throat> A, A, B, B, C, C, D, D. E E F F G G H H I I J J K K One more K and we'd be fucked, crass. L L M M N N O O P P Q Q R R S S T T U U V V W W W dot X X X dot com Y Y N N Z Z Now now I I no no my my a A B B C C's. Next next time time won't won't you you sing sing with with me me. Now I know my ABCs. Any questions, Cross? Uh yeah. What would have happened if we would have added another K? I don't get it. Uh, is that a real website? Google it when you get home. All right, Cross. You're gonna need to know your alphabet because tomorrow. Each and every one of you are going to have to come in front of the class and say your ABCs. And if you miss one letter, you fail the whole class for the whole year. Uh, you said if we miss one letter we fail, but do we have to say every letter twice like you did, or can we just do it the right way? You have to say every letter twice, just like it is up there. They wouldn't put it up there if it wasn't right. So memorize your alphabet, and I'll see you tomorrow, class. Okay, the wrong way. Got it. Oh man, guys, I don't want to talk in front of the class. I'm scared. 
Why? Because I'm afraid I'm going to pee my pants. Well, don't. I can't help it. Every time I talk in front of somebody, I get scared and pee my pants. I'll just do what I do when I talk to people. Imagine me in my underwear. Rock hard eight pack, big pecs, huge dong. I'm talking huge dong crammed into a tiny little speedo. It's so hot. Damn, Cody. Well, Jeffy, you say you pee your pants every time you talk to someone, but you're talking to us. Oh, man. I just pissed my pants. Yeah, my pants are wet, too. Hey, Daddy. Hey, Jeffy, how was school? It was awful. I peed my pants again. You peed your pants again? Yeah, I was just talking to my friends, and I got scared, and I just started peeing my pants. Jeffy, you need to stop peeing your pants. I know, Daddy, but I can't help it. Every time I start talking to someone, I get scared, and then I pee my pants. I'm peeing my pants right now, talking to you. Jeffy, peeing your pants at this age is not normal. You're too old for that. I know, Daddy, and it's going to be even worse tomorrow, because tomorrow, i got to get up in front of the entire class at school and say my ABCs. My pants are going to be all full of piss. Well, Jeffy, why do you keep peeing your pants when you talk to people? Are, are you scared of people? Like, what, do, you, do, you, do you not like people looking at you? No, Danny. I just get so scared when people start looking at me. I wish I was invisible. You wish you were invisible? Yeah. Well, um, I got something that will help you, Jeffy. I got something that will help you. Oh, you do? Yeah, I got you these, uh, invisible glasses. Invisible glasses? Uh, uh-huh. But I can see them. Well, the glasses are invisible, Jeffy. But when you put these glasses on, you'll turn invisible. <gasps> really, Daddy? Yep, yep. And they have magic invisible powder in them. And when you put them on, you turn invisible and nobody will be able to see you. <gasps> can I try them on, Daddy? Yep, you can try them on. But remember, when you put them on, you'll be invisible. I won't be able to see <gasps> Where did Jeffy go? <gasps> where, where's Jeffy? I'm right here, Daddy. Jeffy, where are you? Daddy, I'm right here. Jeffy, where are you? I can't Daddy, right, right here. Where are you? Daddy, right here. Oh, there you are. Jeffy, thank God. I thought I lost you forever. So Whew. they really work, Daddy? Yeah, they work. I couldn't find you, Jeffy. You were, you were gone forever. But, you know, tomorrow when you're at school and you say your ABCs, put those glasses on and the whole class won't be able to see you. Okay. Thanks, Daddy. Yeah, go have fun with them. <sighs> He's such an idiot. All right, class. I hope you all study the alphabet because each and every one of you are going to come up here and say the alphabet. All right, Cody, you're first. Yeah, this is gonna be easy peasy. I'm about to imagine myself in my underwear. Whoa, Jeffy, nice glasses. You can't see me, Junior. I'm invisible. What? Junior, I got these glasses on that make me invisible so no one can see me. They can only hear me. Well, I can see you. No, you can't, Junior. I'm invisible. The goofy glasses. I can do whatever I want. Watch this. All right, Cody, you can start saying your alphabet now. <clears throat> A A B B C C D D E E F F G G. Jeffy, go back to your seat. What? What? J Jeffy, you just hit the teacher in the face. Yep, sure did, and he didn't even see me, cause I'm invisible. Now, if you'll excuse me, there's some things I need to do while I'm invisible. that be? Uh, hello? Hey there, is this your son? Yes, unfortunately. What'd he do? I caught him at the beach smacking girls butts. What? Sure was, daddy. I was smacking the shit out of him. Like whoosh. Yeah, they didn't complain or anything, but I arrested him anyway because he was making me jealous. Whenever he does it, it's cute, but whenever I do it, it's a crime or something. They like, stop grabbing my butt, old man. He was going crazy on them butts. Sure was, daddy. I was getting more ass than a toilet seat. He was. I wish I was him. I wouldn't wash that hand. I didn't plan on it. I, he was supposed to be at school. Oh, he was at school. Ass school. Actually, it was more like ass detention because he was punishing them butts, just spanking them. Yep. Call me Principal Ass Smacker, Daddy. Jeff, you're so grounded. Uh, look, could you just keep an eye on your kid, please? I don't want him going on a rampage around town on all the butts. Oh, I'll make sure I take care of him. Jeffy, get your ass inside. All right, Daddy. <sighs> Jeffy, you skipped school to smack butts on the beach all day. Well, when you put him like that, Daddy, it doesn't sound too bad, now does it? Jeffy, you were supposed to go to school. I did go to school, and I punched my teacher in the face. Why? Because I'm invisible, he couldn't see me, and I can do whatever I want. Jeffy, you're not invisible. Yes, I am. 
daddy. You gave me these glasses and told me that they made me invisible. So now no one can see me. Jeffy, you're not invisible. I lied. I said those glasses made you invisible so you had a better time talking in front of the class. I lied. You're not invisible. I can see you. Oh, yeah? Well, if you can see me, how many fingers am I holding up? Four. Hmm. Well, I can't even see how many fingers I'm holding up because I'm invisible and I can't see my own fingers. Jeffy, you're not invisible. I can see you. Daddy, I think you're just jealous because your hand doesn't smell like butt. What, J Jeffy, why, why would I be? I'm not jealous of that. Oh, yeah? Well, then how many butts did you smack today, Daddy? Zero. All right, well, I got six more than you. <sighs> smell my hand, Daddy. It smells like six fat asses. Jeffy, you know what? You're grounded. Go to your room. Oh, yeah, Daddy? even see me if I was in my room. So I'm out this bitch. Hello? Hey there, I'm back. This time I caught him videotaping girls in a public restroom. What? Yep, it was pretty high quality video actually. 1080p, 60 frames a second. I had to uh, confiscate it and download it to my laptop. Hmm. I just got two grand out of my bank account because I ran out of toilet paper. Now, now, now where's my wallet? Hmm. I'll set that right here for now. Oh, oh, here it is. Silly me. You motherfucker! You get the fuck back here! I'm gonna shoot your ass! Oh, damn, I got shot! What? Yeah, hey there, Mario. Jeffy got shot. How? Well, he was trying to steal money from an ATM and somebody shot him. Trying to steal money from an ATM? Yeah, don't worry though, I can't arrest him because he's a minor, so. Bad! This bad! You do not steal things! No! Bad! Alright, that's about all I got. Jeffy, why are we trying to steal money from an ATM? Because I'm invisible! They couldn't see me! Jeffy, if you're invisible, then how'd you get shot? Because he was just randomly shooting, and he 360 no-scoped me because he's a PC player, that bitch! You know what, Jeffy? I'm done with those glasses. You're not having the glasses anymore! But Danny, I need my invisible glasses! No! What, invisible glasses? What's he talking about? Okay, look, I, I told him that these glasses will make him invisible when he puts them on because he had a project at school and he was afraid to talk in front of the class, so I said when he put these glasses on, they made him invisible. Well, well, like, do they make him invisible? No, you just saw him! But are you sure? Because he, he got away with a lot of stuff today. He smacked butts. Yeah, he got really lucky for smacking the butts, but these glasses don't do anything. They're just normal, stupid, ugly-looking, goofy glasses. Huh. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to confiscate those glasses. Uh, I don't want them, uh, falling into the wrong hands. You know, I, I, I can't risk these actually turning somebody invisible. But they won't. They don't work. They're not real. I just made that up. Oh, I'll be the judge of that. Uh, but, but, but I have to take these for, uh, for, uh, evidence. So I'm just gonna go take these to the bathroom. Um, I mean, I mean the, the, the evidence room. Because the, these are evidence. So that's, that's where I'm going. But, bye. see me, can't you? Alright, Jeffy, today is me and Rosalina's five-year anniversary of knowing each other. Good. So I bought her a star. You bought her a star? You can buy stars? Yep, you can buy stars. Where'd you get it from? A star salesman. Where did he get it from? What? I don't know, Jeffy. Well, how much did it cost? It only cost $100. $100? That's cheap. It's like there's a trillion of them. Well, Rosalina's always wanted a star, so I decided to buy her one. Well, can we go to it? No, Jeffy. It's like a million light years away. Well, then what are we doing with it? All you do is look at it. Look at it? You pay $100 to look at something? Why don't you just give me $100 and you can look at me? Because nobody wants to look at you, Jeffy. Well, that's rude. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go stand on the corner and say, pay me $100. Look at me. Mario! Oh, Rosalina's coming. Shut up. Don't, don't ruin the surprise. Hey, Mario! Surprise! surprise. Oh, what's happening? What? Today's our five-year anniversary of knowing each other. It is? Yes. We've known each other for five years, Mario? Yes. I'm five years older than the day we met? Yes. Oh my gosh, Mario, that's so exciting. I completely forgot. It's, it's, it's okay. I'm sorry, I didn't get you anything, but um, I'll make it up to you later. <laughs> Daddy, go ahead. You old plumber, you. Go lay some pipe. <laughs> She's talking about that. <laughs> Jeffy, shut up. 
Well, look, baby, I bought you a Star Mario anniversary. <gasps> you bought me a Star Mario? Can we go look at it? But get this, Mommy. All you can do is look at it. She knows that, Jeffy. Just shut up. You're going to stay here. Let's go look at the star, baby. Oh, okay. Let's go. Well, I want to look at the star. Shut up, Jeffy. You're playing another character in the next scene. Well, Lance knows that, but I don't know that. All right, so here's the plan. I sold the guy that lives in that house over there a star. Now when Oh, wait, 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 wait. You're selling stars, mate. I want a star. No, no, no I, I didn't really sell him a star. It, it's just like, it's just a piece of paper. Well, why'd he get a star? I want a star. Wait, don't worry about it. Just, just focus, okay? All now, right. he and his girlfriend are going to come outside to look at the star. And when they do, I want you to pretend to steal his girlfriend's purse. Then, I'm going to come over and pretend to beat you up. And then she'll want to be with me instead of him, because I'm a hero. <laughs> Look at these abs. <laughs> but, uh, what if she doesn't have a purse, mate? She'll have a purse. She's a girl. But what if she doesn't have a purse? She'll have a purse, okay? Now, just try to steal it, and then whenever I come over, I'm gonna punch you. And then you act like I punched you really hard, like it was a super punch, okay? Alright, mate. I got it. Which one is it, Mario? I think it's that one. Or that one. Or it could be that one. Ooh, what about that one? That one's so pretty! Baby, that's the moon. Oh. Well, what about that one? I hope it is! You know, that's the one. That's the one right there! Oh, yeah! Give me a purse! Oh, give me a purse! Oh, give me a purse! Oh, give me a purse! Give me a purse! Oh, oh, give me a purse! Oh, 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 yes, I I I I give me a purse! I can call one Give me a purse! Looks like a job for Super D! Oh no! Super D and his good looks! Unhand that beautiful woman! Powie! No, you just won't wait the last of me! Super D, you saved my life! Yeah, don't mention it, babe. It's what I do. Mario, you didn't do anything! Well, I was gonna do something! Like, I didn't know if he had a knife or if he was gonna hurt me. Like, I tried to look for my phone so I could call 911, but I didn't want to get hurt. Mario, you just stood! I was about to kick him. No, all you did was just sit there and cry like a little baby. No, 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 I was totally gonna kick him, but then I didn't want to, like, I didn't know if he was wearing a belt and I was gonna hit the hard part and then stub my toe. Well, I'm glad Super D was here because he saved my life. Oh, come on, babe. You've had a pretty rough night. Let's go in and lay down. What? No, 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 no. no. Come lay down, babe. You might have a concussion. My head's fine. I'm just a little shaken up. Just let me know if you need mouth to mouth. All right, Super Dweeb. You can leave. I got it from here. Hey, Danny. How'd the star go? Oh, wait. Let me guess. I bet it looked like a little white dot in the sky. Not right now, Jeffy. Mario, how could you just stand there and do nothing? I was going to do something. I just didn't want to step in yet. I was counting three Mississippis because I thought you had him. Had him? He was twice my size. Well, you know, I just, you know, I didn't want to step in because if I would have hit him, you know, I didn't want to hurt him too bad. Bro, just admit that you're too scrawny. I'm not scrawny. Look at this muscle. <laughs> My thumb is bigger than your whole arm. That's quite big. Well, that may be true, but I don't want big arms. Big arms are gross. You don't like long arms, Mario? I have long arms. I didn't say anything about long arms. I said big arms are gross. Bro, you're just really tiny. You have no muscles. I'm not tiny. I got, I got a lot of muscle. I'm big. Daddy, you are pretty tiny. I'm 16, and look how big I am. Rawr, I'm a big Jeffy, Daddy. You better watch out. Rawr. Mario, I'm taller than you, too. Well, it doesn't matter how short I am. I'm still really strong. Like I, I can beat people up. Like I step on turtles. That's pretty messed up, bro. And I step on caterpillars. Caterpillars? So you just stomp on stuff that can't fight back? Wait, wait, I mean, in my games, I step on a lot of animals. I mean, that's not... Look, 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 I could beat up people, and if I saw that robber again, I'd punch him in the face, and, and he'd go blind, because I'd punch him so hard, he'd go blind. Oh, really? You would? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I saw that robber again, I'd be like, and he'd go blind, and he'd go Like, he would be, like, hurt. He'd be really hurt. Like, I better not see his face again, because... Because he'd get the hurt put on him. Really, Mario? You would do that for me? Yeah, I, I would do that for you, baby. I would hurt him and, and, and show you that I'm a man. What, you're really falling for this? Yes, he said he would save me, and I believe him. Yeah, I would. I, I, I'd, I'd beat him up. If, if I saw him again, I'd beat him up. Okay, well, we'll see what happens next time. Nani? Yeah, yeah, well, there won't be a next time, because we're never going outside ever again. We're going to sit here on this couch... You know, because I'm not tiny. I'm a man. I, I, I'll do anything for my baby, you know? <laughs> All right, man. I'm going to need another favor from you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you like how I reacted to you hit me earlier? 
uh, it was okay. You could use a little bit more practice. All right, mate. Okay, so for some reason, she's still with that lame guy from earlier. So I need you to break into their house, and then the guy says he can beat you up, but he can't. So just, you know, try to steal her purse again, and he might hit you a few times, but just pretend it doesn't hurt. Well, what if it hurts, mate? It's not gonna hurt. He's pretty scrawny. You'll be fine. All right. Well, how do I pretend that it's not gonna hurt, mate? I, I don't know. Just just don't flinch. You, you'll, you'll beat him up. It's fine. Don't worry about it. All right, and how do I get in the house? Well, they don't lock the front door, so just you can just walk right in. All right, mate. I'm on it. Mario, would you really ever fight that man if we saw him again? Oh, yeah, baby. I would totally fight him. Like, I would totally protect you, you know, because I'm a man. And if I ever saw him again, I'd punch him right in the face and, and beat him up. He's just, I wasn't prepared last time, but now I'm totally prepared. Give me your purse! Ah! Give me your purse right now! Save me! Ah, how'd you get inside the house? The front door now. Give me your purse! Ah! I'm gonna fight him. I, I, I just, I, I, I have to, oh man, I have to pee. What? Oh, I have to pee so bad. But Mario, you said you would fight him. I haven't peed like all day. Like, let, let me go pee real quick and then I'll fight. Okay, so let me just go pee and grab my phone and call 911. Mario! So, uh, how's your night going? Pretty bad, actually. Mm hmm. Ah. Uh, so, uh, do you even have a purse? No. Oh, he lied to me. <laughs> you got off of my mommy right now! Yeah, 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 no, 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 I, I was gonna do that. All right, guys, I got my phone. I was calling 911. Everything's fine. You're too late, Mario. Jeffy already saved me. I was gonna do it, but he beat me to it. Well, I, I was gonna do it, too. Mario, you ran away. Well, I didn't run away, baby. I had to pee. It, it, it's bad to hold in your bladder because it, it could hurt your bladder. So I, I had to go pee, baby. You know that's what it was. Mario, you said you were gonna save me and fight for me. Well, I, I was going to, but, you know, like, Jeffy got him. I'll get him the next one. I, I'll get the next one because, you know... We'll just make sure the door is locked so people can't get in. Mario, sometimes I wish you were stronger and you would defend me. What? 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 Uh, oh, yeah. What, what's that, babe? Uh, oh, you, you want me to come with you because you love my big muscles? <laughs> Sorry, man. I get so, um, Daddy, what do you want me to do with this guy? I don't know, Jeffy. All right. I guess I'll just go put him in the river. Yeah. I wish I was bigger. I want to call for some help. A little later. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Oh, thank God you're here, doctor. I have an embarrassing problem. That's okay. You can tell me I'm a doctor. I won't tell anyone. You promise you won't tell anyone? I'm not allowed to tell anyone. That'd be a hippo violation. A hippo violation? Yeah, yeah, I'd get in big trouble. All right, well, my embarrassing problem is I want to be bigger. Oh, okay. I think I see where this is going. I'm just too small and I don't satisfy my wife, so if I was bigger, I could satisfy her. Yeah, join the club. We're getting t-shirts made next month. We're calling ourselves the Teeny Peenies. I don't want to be known as the Teeny Peeny. Neither do I, but I'm the Alita. Well, look, I just want to be bigger, so can you make me bigger? Well, I don't really know if I can help with that. I mean, you definitely don't want to try tying a weight to it and stretching it out that way. Believe me, I've done that. It hurts. Well, I thought we're supposed to lift weights to get bigger. Not like that. You're going to hurt yourself. Well, it's just that my, my wife's ex-boyfriend said that his thumb was bigger than me. Oh, ow, that hurts. And it's true, it is. And I, and I was like, well, I don't want to be bigger. That's gross. I mean, yeah, we all say that. But now I want to be bigger. Yeah, exactly. So can you do something to make me bigger? Well, I mean, there's those websites that say they can help you, but they'll just steal your credit card information. Believe me, I've tried that too. I've had to call the bank numerous times, and they're like, Guy, why do you keep falling for this? And I'm like, I'm really desperate, man. I'm desperate too. Like, I just want to be really tall and have a bunch of muscles and a six-pack abs. Wait, wait. You, you want to be tall? Yeah, I want to be bigger. Like, I want to be tall and, like, big muscles. Like, I want to be bigger. Oh, I, I thought you would... Well, it, it doesn't really matter what I thought, but it, I mean, I, I was talking about you being tall, too, right? Like earlier, like when I was saying those things. Yeah, we're talking about tall, right? Yeah, we're talking about tall. And yeah. muscles? Yeah, muscles, yeah. Oh, well, I guess I'll just deal with deal with what I got. Yeah. Hey, Dad, I got an idea. What? What if you eat one of those mushrooms from your game, and then you get bigger that way? <laughs> what a big idea, Jeffy. That's your big idea. Jeffy's big idea. <laughs> wow, you know, for a minute there, I thought Mario's name was going to be in the title. I was getting nervous. Viewer retention was like... Now it's like... Cha -ching. <laughs> Thanks for that big idea, Jeffy. Well, how are we going to do Jeffy's big idea? Like, I need a mushroom for my game, and I don't know if those exist. Well, uh, I, I know a guy I went to college with that could probably hook you up with some mushrooms. You, uh, you want to meet him? Yeah, yeah let's go meet him. Okay.
Hey, you Mario? Uh, yeah, uh, Brun guy said I'm supposed to meet you about some mushrooms. Yeah, I heard you want to get big. Oh yeah, I want to get real big. Okay, I can hook you up. I got this. Whoa, what is that? That's a mushroom. Now it's gonna do one of two things. It's gonna either make you big, or it's gonna make you eat someone's face and talk to chairs. Wh well, I really hope it makes me big. Yeah, I hope so too, for your sake. Well, how big is it gonna make me? I don't know, like twice your size? Twice my size? That's still not that big. Uh, okay, okay, I can make you bigger. I also have this. Whoa, what is that? Now that's a mega mushroom. It'll either make you really, really big, or it'll make you want to eat 10 people's faces and talk to trees. Okay, well I really hope it makes me really, really big. Yeah, well what I would recommend is you take the small one first, and if that doesn't work, you take the big one. Okay, yeah, deal. I'll be really safe with it. All right, be careful. All right, I got the stuff. So how's this supposed to work? He says that if I eat this one, it'll either make me bigger, or make me want to eat people's faces. Oh, okay. I'll just watch from back here. All right, so I just eat it? I guess. All right, here I go. Anything happening? Oh, let me eat your face! Ah! I'm just joking with you. Oh, jeez, you had me there. I haven't ate it yet. All right, here I go. Oh, am I bigger? Whoa, yeah, yeah, you're about as big as me. Whoa, that's not big enough. Super D is huge! What? Super D? What? what? I, I thought we were talking about height. Alright, so I'm gonna try the other one because I feel big, but I want to be bigger. Okay. Um, nom, 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 nom. Ooh, mamma mia! Wow, you are huge! Super D, I'm coming for you! Okay, what is this Super D you keep talking about? Super D! Yeah, I bet you have one now. Uh, mamma mia! Mario can be so irresponsible sometimes. Ugh, I know. I just wish he was more protective over me. Yeah, you remember how protective I was over you? Yeah, that was the one good thing about our relationship. Yeah, I never let anything happen to my baby. You know, it doesn't mean it can't happen again. We should totally kiss. <gasps> but I'm married, Super D! Well, I don't care if you have a husband. Husband ends in and anyway, so you should just end it. Actually, it ends in and. Well, and we should totally kiss. It'd be hot. Super D, I don't want to kiss you. But I saved you today, so like, you owe me. Get away from me, Super D. Oh, come on, look at these abs. Ugh, who wouldn't want this? Ew, no! Get away from my wife, Super D. Ugh, so rock hard. <laughs> I did it, baby! I'm huge! Mario, you saved me from Super D! Yeah? Ugh. Mario, you're back to normal! Uh, dang it, it wore off! What wore off? I took some mushrooms to make me really big because I know you don't like how small I am. Mario, size doesn't matter. I love you just the way you are. I'm paralyzed from the neck down. Wait, size doesn't matter to you? I, I thought you wanted me to be really big. No, Mario. I just wanted you to protect me. No, seriously, guys. I can't feel my legs. Well, I'm sorry that I didn't protect you earlier today, but I'll start protecting you from now on. I'm going to be the most bestest protective boyfriend ever. Really, Mario? Super D needs to go to the super ICU. Yes, really. I, I don't need mushrooms or any of that. I just need you to care about me and, and I'll care about you and protect you. And let's go look at that star I got you for our anniversary. Okay, Mario. Hey, 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 somebody needs to help me though. Mario, which star is it again? Any star you want, baby. I want them all. <laughs> well, they cost like $100 a piece, so I can't do that. Give me a pass! <laughs> Give me a pass right now! See, baby, I just stood up for you. Mario, you did it! Yeah, I gotta go pay him $20. All right, class. Today, we're gonna be having a class president erection. If you become class president, you get to make any rule for the class that you want. And I can't say anything about it. So which one of you wants to be the class president? Ooh, I want to be class president. Junior, do not take this erection from me. I want to be class president. Well, I want to be class president. Well, you're too stupid to be class president. Well, you're too dorky to be class president. Yeah. I, <laughs> I want to be class president. But well, you can't be class president because I want to be class president. I want to be class president. I want to be class president. Settle down, settle down, class. There can only be one class president. That's why we're having an erection, okay? It's gonna be a long, hard process for my erection. So I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna choose two people to have erection. It's going to be uh, Cody. 
Cody and Jeffy. Jeffy. You guys come up to the crest and be part of my erection and tell the crest why they should vote for you as crest president. All right, I'm gonna go first. All right, prepare to lose. All right, if you guys elect me as class president, then there will be no more homework ever again. Homework will be illegal. No, 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 I actually think we should have homework because we might forget the stuff we learned at school and we have to keep learning because learning is power. Who's with me? Junior, don't throw paper balls at me. All right, change your plans. If I'm elected class president, then all the homework that we get will go to this guy because he likes it so much. <laughs> No, 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 okay, okay, how about this, watch this. How about, if I'm elected class president, we're gonna have healthier school lunches, like celery, so that means no more pizza. Junior, stop throwing things! Well, if I'm elected class president, then every day will be pizza day. There will be pizza parties every single day. Your desk will be made out of pizza. You will even be made out of pizza. No, no, no. Okay, okay, how about this, how about this? If I'm elected class president, uh, you don't have to wear clothes to school anymore. So, so like, you, you know how long it takes to get dressed in the morning? What, what, you, you don't have to do that. You can just come naked. And, and no girls allowed. Well, if I'm elected class president, you won't even have to come to school anymore! Yeah. And then you won't be president of anything. Oh, okay, 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 how about this? Uh, uh, if, you, if you fail a test, you can retake it! How about, how about that? Well, if I'm elected class president, you won't even have tests anymore! Uh, but, but you can't just do that. All right, class, I've heard enough. So who do you guys want to be the class president? So who wants Jeffy for president? Who wants Cody for president? Yeah. Oh, stop. All right, class, we have a winner. Jeffy has won the erection, and he is now your class president. Uh -huh. Yay! More. <laughs> How do you think Jeffy's stay at school is going? It must be going pretty good. I mean, we haven't gotten a call from his teacher saying he's suspended for anything, like pooping his pants or biting another student. Aww, Daddy! Hey, Jeffy, how was your day at school? Daddy, you can't call me Jeff anymore. You have to call me Mr. Class President. Jeffy, you got class president? I sure did, Mommy. All the kids in class said I was the smartest kid, and now I'm the class president. This, is, this must be something like a pity award or like a Make-A-Wish Foundation thing. Mario. What the, why would they vote Jeffy class president? Like, wh what are you even going to do for the class? Well, dang, the first thing I did was cancel school. So now I never have to go to school ever, ever again. Jeffy, you can't make those rules. You can't just cancel school. Yes, I can, because I'm the class president. No, Jeffy, the only way you could cancel school is if you were the real president. Well, how do I get to be? the real president. You can't. You can't because you're a kid and you're just too stupid to be the president. Hey Mario, speaking of the president, isn't it election day today? Oh, it is. Let's turn on the news and see how it's going. Breaking news, UK. The president of the United States has something to say before the election tonight. Let's go to that. When I, Donna J. Trump, is re-elected president again, we do not want to share the moon with anyone ever again, okay? So what I will do when I'm re-elected is I will hire Space Force to build a wall, a huge wall, around the moon. So then it will be our moon and all the other countries will pay for that wall. A wall around the moon? Daddy, can I do stupid stuff like that? No, Jeffy, you can only do stupid stuff like that if you're the president. Well, I want to be president. Jeffy, you'll never be president, ever. Mario, Jeffy can do anything he sets his mind to. Thanks, Mommy. Well, he'll never be president. He cannot be president. He can set his mind to as much as he wants, but he'll never be president. <laughs> Who's at the door? Hold on. Uh, hello? Hey, man. Uh, hey, I, I got a really huge problem, and I, I need your help. W what is it? Well, hey, can I come inside? Because it's like November, and it's freezing out here, and I'm just wearing short sleeves and no pants. Uh, yeah, sure, come on inside. Okay. All right, so what's the problem? Well, this is going to sound kind of silly, but you know how there's an election today? Yeah. Yeah, well, we lost the other guy. What do you mean you lost the other guy? I mean, we don't know where he is. Like, like we were playing hide-and-seek, and we just never found him, so he's just, like, gone now. Okay, so then why are you here? Well, I'm here to try to find somebody 
Bernie who wants to run for president and try to beat Trump in this election, and I was kind of hoping that'd be you. Me? Why me? Because you're Mario! Everybody loves you, you know? They recognize you from the games, and they'll be like, oh, it's that guy! Well, I can't run for president because I wasn't born in America. Oh, okay. Well, what about you? I'm from outer space. What? Okay, is anybody here from America? Right here. Well, how old are you? Sixteen. Uh, okay, we just won't tell anyone. Well, no, Jeffy cannot run for president. Well, look, he's the best I have right now. Um, I gotta say something. If I poop in a strainer, it makes poop spaghetti. See, look, he cannot be president of the country. Uh, it'll work. Okay, okay, Jeffy, uh, come with me. You're gonna go debate the president. Okay. Well, no, no, no! Hello and welcome to the presidential debate. Tonight, we have President Donald Trump versus Jeffy. All right, I'm going to ask both of you questions, so just answer those as best you can. Mr. President, we'll start with you. Why should you be re-elected president? So, they should elect me president because I'm already president and I'm already living in the White House, okay? And so, if they didn't re-elect me, it would take me approximately like four years to move all my knickknacks and paddy wax and give a doggy bone out of the White House. It would take billions upon billions of boxes to get all of my stuff out of there. So to make it easier on me, Donna J. Trump, you should just re-elect me president so I don't have to move all my stuff out of the office. All right. Now, Jeffy, your turn. Same question. Why should you be elected president? Wrong. M Mr. President, pl please don't interrupt. He, he hasn't even said anything, so he, he can't be wrong yet. You should vote for me for president because if I was president, I would ban all school. No kid would ever have to go to school ever again, and they get to stay home and play video games all day. Also, I would ban green beans and make them illegal because you're disgusting and icky, and I I hate green beans! First of all, no one should ban green beans because no one has done more for green beans than I, Donald J. Trump, since the Jolly Green Giant. Shut up! Green beans need to be banned because they're disgusting and they're shaped like little green pee peas. Uh, wrong! Carrots are better! Wrong! No one likes green beans! Wrong, 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 wrong. Break it up, you two. All right, we're gonna go on to the next question. Now, Jeffy, in your opinion, what is the biggest problem in the world right now? The biggest problem in the world right now is Fortnite. Every time they update the seasons, it gets worse and worse. To be honest, I don't even recognize the game anymore. So let's make Fortnite great again. Wrong. Oh, you actually like the dumb updates? All right, all right, all right. Okay, Mr. President, same question. What do you think is the biggest problem in the world right now? Okay, so the biggest problem in the world right now is that Legos are too small. Okay, this causes a choking hazard for billions upon billions of children every single day. Okay, so what I'm proposing is, is that we make these tiny, puny little Legos huge, okay? We're gonna call them huge blocks, okay? So, so kind of like mega blocks? I'm sorry, what? Mega blocks. Oh, mega blocks. Yes, that's exactly what I would call them. Mega blocks, because we would be making America great again, one block at a time. No, no, they're, they're called mega blocks. Oh, uh, oh, uh, th yes. This right here is exactly what I'm talking about. So, if you notice, to show you guys a little bit of a diagram. This is our border wall with the previous administration, and this is our border wall with my administration, the Trump administration. So, yeah. And also, 
These are the exact same blocks that I want the border wall around the moon to be built out of. So, the wall will be huge! I actually like the tiny Legos. The big ones are for babies. Wrong. Mr. President, could you please stop saying wrong? Wrong. All right, that is it for the presidential debate. Wrong. Okay, you know what, whatever, I'm, I'm going home. We're just gonna see who wins tonight. There's no way Jeffy wins the election tonight. Don't say that, Mario, we have to believe in him. I don't believe nobody would vote for him. <laughs> hey, hey, did they announce who won yet? No, they're about to. Oh, good. Breaking news! Okay, the election results are in, and the next president of the United States is Jeffy. What's that mean? No way. Jeffy, you're president! Yippee! He did it! That crazy son of a gun actually did it. Jeffy, what are you gonna do now that you're president? Well, first of all, I get to poop wherever I want. Yes, you can, Mr. President. And you also get this, the nuclear football. What's that? Well, this will let you nuke just about anything. Well, the first thing I'm going to nuke is all the green bean farms and all the schools. Oh, no, 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 Jeffy, no, 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 you can't do that, because if you nuke that, you're going to nuke our country, and we're all going to die. Well, that's a small price to pay for me to be happy. Well, no, no, Jeffy, don't you do it. Ah, run for your life! Ah! Goofy goober, yeah. Jeffy, what are you doing? What's up, Pops? What's hopping out the gates? Jeffy, what are you talking about? I'm asking you what you're doing, Daddy. I'm sitting on the couch, Jeffy. What are you doing? Daddy, you know, I'm out here maxing, relaxing, posted up, bunny hopping, floor mopping. I'm out here cashing checks and taking names, but I'm not taking names because I'm too busy cashing checks. Daddy, I'm out here getting receipts. What, Jeffy, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't understand what you just said. Daddy, I got some tea. And I'm not talking Arizona. So today, I was absolutely 100 busting at school, and the teacher was being so sus, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to send it. I'm going to full send, Daddy. So I flipped him the birdie. Tweet, tweet. Kid behind me said that we absolutely stand. But I was like, I'm still sitting. And that's on Hundo P, Daddy. Jeffy, I have no idea what you just said. I did not understand a single word you just said. That's because you're old, Daddy. You're a boomer. Well, Jeffy, I'm not old. Oh, on my back. See, that's exactly what a boomer would say. Plus, you're bald. Well, uh, I'm not bald, Jeffy. Jeffy, look, look, I'm not old and I'm not a boomer, okay? I'm just... I'm just a little old, but not not too old. And bald. Well, hold on, Jeffy. Let me see who's at the door. All right, Daddy. Uh, hello? Hey, old man. I lost my tennis ball and it went in your backyard. Can you get it for me? Wh why are you playing with a tennis ball at night? Mind your own business, old man. Stop calling me old man. I'm not old. Uh, just shut up, old man, and give me my tennis ball before you croak. <sighs> Fine. Here, here's your tennis ball. Throw it to me. What, throw it to you? Yeah, huh? Okay, that's pretty far. Yeah, huh? Alright. Oh, my back! <laughs> You're old! I'm not old! Shut up! Oh, my back. Send it to Elmo and... Uh, Daddy, why are you uh, digging in your butt? I'm not digging in my butt, Jeffy. I'm grabbing my back. Why are you digging in your butt? I'm not... Jeffy, shut up! Oh, Daddy, I sent a picture of my hog to Elmo, and I said, tickle this. What, Jeffy, that's so stupid. I think I'm gonna call a doctor, because my back is killing me, Jeffy. What? You can use the phone to call the doctor. Jeffy, that's not a real phone. Well, then who got the picture of my hog? Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Yes, I did, doctor. My back hurts, and I'm just getting old. Ugh, yeah, I know the feeling of getting old. It sucks. Things just don't work like they're supposed to, you know? It's just, uh, not getting up like it used to. You know, you slap it around, you call it names, you tug on it like a shoestring, but nothing. Not even a tingle. You get your favorite stepsister video up, you know, and mom and dad are out of the house, and they're never gonna find out, and it's not weird, because they don't have the same parents, but... It's also kind of weird, because, like, they're supposed to be brother and sister, so it's just the right kind of weird. Oh, it's so hot. Ugh, I saw this one video, eight Nerf basketball. Oh, look, look my, my back hurts, and I'm just getting old. Like, can you fix my back pain? Oh, well, there's really nothing you can do about that. It's just part of getting old. <sighs> I hate getting old. Hold on. I got a text message. Ew, somebody sent me a picture of their hog, and it's all hairy. Right here. Well, look at this hairy hog. Well, ew, that's a huge hog. Yeah, it's the biggest hog I've ever seen. It's definitely bigger than mine. So what are we going to do about me getting old? Well, nothing. It's just part of life, you know? Father time always wins in the end. Unless you're Tom Brady. Woo! Have you seen that man? He must have found the fountain of youth or something. 
man, I'm also getting bald. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> Look at you. Uh, yeah, I'm going bald too. Look, but at least I'm not as bald as you. What are you like, 50? <sighs> Jeffy, Daddy's getting old. Well, Daddy, better start writing that will and increase your life insurance policy. <sighs> Jeffy, I'm just gonna watch TV. Hey, old freaks! Are you tired of being old? Are you tired of your back hurting and your bones popping? Are you going bald? Well, I was too. Until I discovered Youth Juice! I found the fountain of youth, and I bottled that mf -er. Now look at me. I'm bald, I'm pushing 50, I'm getting old. But with one sip of Youth Juice... Mm. <sighs> ah. Whoa! I'm in my 20s again! Now I'm young, dumb, and full of... Youth Juice! Buy it now! Oh my god, Youth Juice! Jesus Christ, Daddy, calm down! Oh, Jeffy, did you see that? It's Youth Juice! Oh, it gave him a full head of hair, it looks so gorgeous! I have to get some of that! I have to get some of that! Come on, Big Bird, answer! Oh, oh man, I got the last bottle! I'm gonna be so young and hot and not old! Hey, Daddy, I'm thirsty. Well, go downstairs and get something to drink, Jeffy. Oh man, I can't wait to try it! <sighs> Who's at the door? Hey, Daddy, I'm thirsty. Daddy? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, drink. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, hey, old man. Uh, my son lost his tennis ball in your backyard again, and he needs you to get it for him before you croak. W why did your son come and ask for it himself? Uh, he was embarrassed that this was the second time tonight. <sighs> Fine, I'm gonna get it. <sighs> Here it is. Throw it to me. Are you serious? Yeah, huh? <sighs> That's really far. <clears throat> Oh, on my back! <laughs> You're old! Oh. <sighs> Stupid kid. What? Hey! What happened to my youth juice? <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> oh, Jimmy! What, what happened to you? You're a baby! Jimmy said we in the Ungu juice. Juice? Jimmy! You drank the youth juice and. Oh no! You're a baby! <laughs> that means. I have to restart the 18 years of taking care of you! Oh no! I have to call a doctor! I have to call a doctor! Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Oh, thank God you're here, doctor. See, look, I bought some youth juice. Oh, and... youth juice. Yeah, I heard of this stuff. It's dangerous. If you drink too much, you turn into a baby. Well, that's what happened to my son. Man, that is an ugly baby. He looks like a fat frog, like a toad. Well, we'll fix him. Well, I don't know what to tell you, man. You're just going to have to wait for him to grow up. Well, no, he, he was 15 years old. He was three years away from being 18. I was almost free. Well, okay, you raised him once. You can do it again, right? No, I do not want to raise him for 18 more years. I don't even know how to take care of a baby. Well, I could help you. Well, you will. Well, calm, calm down just for a few minutes, okay? Just till the end of the video. I'm not going to sit here and help you raise a baby for 18 years. I'm not your wife. Okay, well, well what do we do with the baby? Oh, okay. I got this. I'm great with babies. Well, you are? Oh, yeah. I love babies, and babies love me. I I'm a real hit with the babies. I do this trick where I pretend I stole their nose. Check this out. Oh, I, I, I got your nose! <laughs> I don't... Hey, I, I, I actually... Hey, hey... Hey, idiot! I don't really have your nose, you big, stupid, idiot, dumb baby! Well, well maybe, maybe you should calm God, down. God, I hate babies. you <laughs> What, what is this? No. Listen to him trying to talk. Those aren't words, idiot. What are you doing? Shut up. Maybe maybe we should just go get him some toys, you know, so he, so he can play with some stuff. Yeah, maybe that'll work. Here we are. All right, Jeffy, we got you a bunch of toys to play with, so play with whatever you want. Yeah, yeah, wee wee. Wee wee. Stop it. Put it down. Put it down. Look, you put the donuts on the stick. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, but, oh, yeah. Oh. Just like that, yeah. Oh, yeah, you did it, Jeffy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like that. <laughs> Look at stupid. He can't even stack those donuts right. What an idiot. <sighs> Why won't this fit? Oh, Jeffy, do you want to play with this? Look, 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 look. <laughs> My song, Mozart. It sucks. What? Hey, don't. Things at me. I, I, I will, I will punch a baby. I've done it before. Hey, stop throwing things at me. Oh, that is it. Oh, no, 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 don't hit him. Don't hit him. Wait, did you smell that? Oh, did, did you just poop your pants? D did I? Yeah, it, don't be embarrassed if you did. Obviously, it was the baby. Oh, well, why didn't he just use a toilet? Because he's a baby. Oh, oh, okay, let's change his diaper together. Uh, all right, Jeffy, we're going to change your diaper, okay? <laughs> Uh, Jeffy, are you done? I don't think he's done. 
You, you, you have to stop pooping for me to change your diaper. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're done now, so let me just. <laughs> okay, I'm not changing that. I'm not changing that. that is... Change my diaper now! No, 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 can you change it? No, no, I am not changing that. Change my diaper! Change it, change it, change it, change it! Oh, we're not changing it, Jeffy. That's too disgusting. <laughs> oh, great, now he's crying. Hey, 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 look at, look at the kitty. See, the kitty is going. Right. Jeff, Jeff, look, look at the kitty. No, no, change my diaper. Uh, 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 let me let me talk some cartoons. Some, some cartoons. What? No, no. Well, well, watch the TV. Well, watch the TV, Jeffy. Hey, young people, are you tired of being young and cool? Don't you wish you could just be old so you could do things like rent a car or go to a casino or get the senior citizens discount? Well, me too. That's why I invented old juice. One sip of this, and you'll be rocking the nursing home, getting all the elderly babes. Now, right now, I'm young and hot, but that's about to change. See, I'm old. Uh, buy old juice so you can be old like me. What? Where, where am I? What? What? What is it? I'm old and I'm scared. Uh, I have to poop. Oh my God! Look, old juice. That's exactly what we need. Okay, hey, look. You watch Jeffy so I can go get the old juice. Okay? Okay. What are you looking at, you stupid, dumb baby? Come on, you don't know how to use a remote. Ow! Oh, oh, that is it! Come here! Oh my god, look! I got the old juice! I got it! What, what happened to you? Oh, uh, uh Jeffy, uh... I mean, I, uh, fell into that toy. Oh, well, well, let's get this thing off you. No, no, ow, ow, don't touch it, don't touch it. Ugh. All right, Jeffy, well, we need you to drink the old juice, okay? Mm. What? Mm. Jeffy, Jeffy, drink it! Mm. Jeffy, look, you're gonna drink this. I didn't have to. Yes, you do, Jeffy. You have to drink it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Jeffy, drink it. No. <sighs> oh, okay, how are we gonna get Jeffy to drink this? Yeah, I, I wouldn't force uh, uh, him. Yeah, see. Uh, Jeffy? Uh, hey, do you think we should put it in a bottle? Uh, yeah, yeah, in a bottle. That could work. Okay, let's get a yeah, bottle. Yeah, we got one good, one good juice. All right, Jeffy, here's your bottle, so drink it. Uh -uh. Jeffy, drink the bottle. Uh -uh. Jeffy, drink it. Uh -uh. How do I get him to drink it? Pretend it's a big fake hoo-hoo. <gasps> yeah, dude, a big fake hoo-hoo. Yeah, just, just be like this cat. <laughs> Jeffy, you're back to normal! Yay, I'm not a baby anymore! Yeah, you're not a stupid baby anymore. You wanna catch these hands again? No! Well, Jeffy, I'm glad you're back to normal. <sighs> well, Daddy, this stuff tastes good. Let me get another hit of that. Oh, no, no, Jeffy, no, no, no! <gasps> Jeffy, oh, no, you're old! Huh? <sighs> hey, Danny. Huh? 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 Huh?